They're one of the most significant discoveries of the 20th century, and now genetic sampling of the Dead Sea Scrolls has tested understandings that the 2,000-year-old artefacts were the work of a fringe Jewish sect and shed light on the drafting of scripture around the time of Christianity's birth. Penina Shaw is from the Israel Antiquities Authority. After the beginning of this research, uh, we all thought that the majority or the, the, the scrolls were written on goatskin. One of the first results uh, of this amazing research, DNA research, is that uh, we now know from the samples that were taken that the majority are written on sheepskin. So it's logical that sheepskin and goatskin would be found in the desert if any of these scrolls were written in the desert. But two results tell us that it's a cowhide. Okay, so we have two fragments that turned out to be cowhide, which means that at least these two were not from the area. Okay, they came from elsewhere. The collection of hundreds of manuscripts and thousands of fragments of ancient Jewish religious texts were discovered in 1947 by local Bedouin in Qumran. Many scholars believed the scrolls originated with the reclusive Essens, who had broken away from the Jewish mainstream. But some academics say the Qumran Trov had various authors and may have been brought from Jerusalem for safekeeping. The Israeli researchers say that two textually different copies of the Book of Jeremiah were brought to Qumran from the outside. They say the findings indicate that the texts were subject to variation and interpretation. Noam Mizrahi, a biblical scholar from Tel Aviv University, says the research has had a major impact on his understanding. That the very material, the biological material of which the scrolls are made is as telling and as informative as the content of the text. And this has changed dramatically my own personal understanding of the Dead Sea Scrolls, and I believe it will also inform many of my colleagues from now on. The research may help safeguard against forgeries of the prized relics.